It's getting like a bolt on the blue. Who did you say it was from? An old boyfriend. What did you say his name was? Mr. Jared Keane. I, I hadn't seen him again since last Christmas. I ran into him when I was over in London. And then just now this e email invited me on a cruise. Problem was close. I tore in my trunk to see what I had suitable for the tropics. And you came up with a gorgeous diamond tiara. It's only rhinestones. I found Tiffany diamond. Anyhow, I should be entertained in style. Yeah, well, that's... Goes to show, huh? You never know what's coming. Come into the bedroom before you undress anymore. Well, this is all I'm going to undress for now. What do you say we just put all this shit behind us, huh? Share a drink? No, thank you. Could have been a celebration for us both. You with your millionaire. And me having a baby. Pajamas. I wore these on my wedding night. And that telephone rings and they tell me I've got a boy. I'm just gonna tear these off and wave them like a flag. When I think of how divine it's gonna be to have such thing as privacy around here once more. This millionaire isn't gonna interfere with your privacy, no? Not in the way you have a mind. This man is a gentleman who respects me. What he wants from me is my companionship. And great wealth sometimes makes people lonely. I wouldn't know anything about that. <clears throat> An educated woman. A woman of intelligence and breathing. And I have those things. Can enhance a man's life immeasurably. But I've been foolish. Casting my pearls before swine. Swine? Yes, swine. Not just talking about you, but of your friend Mr. Mitchell. He dared show here today in his workwear. Shouting vicious stories. Slander he'd gotten from you. Gave him his marching orders, I told him where to go. You did, huh? But then he returned with a box of roses, begging my forgiveness. But some things are not forgivable, so I said farewell and let there be no hard feelings. Was this before or after the email from your millionaire? Email? Yeah, your email. After. 
As a matter of fact, it's funny, I was just about to... As a matter of fact, there wasn't no email. There isn't no millionaire. And Mitch didn't come back with no roses. Because I know where Mitch is. My goddamn thing about lies and imagination. One look at yourself, huh? With your worn out clothes, huh? Stupid tiara, huh? 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 Do you hear me, dear? You hear me? Do you? Huh? Huh? Tell them I'm caught in a trap, I need help, and just send, send them. You left the phone off the hook. I'm expecting a fucking call and you left the phone off the hook. I need to get by you. Get by me? We've well, got plenty of room to get by me now. Now it's you there, you can buy you somehow. Stay back, I warn you. Stay back! Or what? Tough girl, ain't you? Get off me! Come on. Stop fighting this. Stop fighting it! 